two things I love most, lunch and my lady friends. So today I've invited some of my favorite gals, Julie Benz and Sasha Alexander, to dine on some delicious dishes. Hey girls. I'm really excited about today. Life gets very hectic and I don't get enough time to spend with my friends. Julie Benz I've known for ages. We did a movie way, way, way back in the day. And Sasha Alexander I've known just being in the business. These are two amazing ladies that I don't get to spend a lot of time with and it's nice to kind of sit down and break bread as we say. Hello. <gasps> Pretty lady. Ooh, look at those fancy shoes. Sasha Alexander. You might know Sasha from shows like Rizzoli and Isles, NCIS, and Shameless. She works all the time. She's got two kids and she's working and I look up to her. How are you? I'm really good. What's happening? How much, you know, like new baby, don't sleep. You know all about it. I do know all yeah. about it. I've just passed the phase and yeah. now I think, oh. How old are the kids now? The uh, youngest one is? He's gonna be five, five in a couple months. I think the hardest thing to learn with them is that it's all phases. I'm telling myself that. I will sleep again. You, you know? will and you I do know. not look sleep deprived, so <laughs> yay. Woo. <laughs> so what are we doing? We're gonna make homemade tartar sauce because oh. we're having crab cakes today. I love crab cakes. Yay! Yay. I've never made home. I mean, I've never even seen homemade crab cakes. Yeah. Well, you're gonna see it today. So we've got a tablespoon of minced shallots. Okay. And then we're gonna take three fourths cup of mayo. That's straight mayonnaise. But this is straight mayo. So I've got my tablespoon of scallions that I reserved from when I chopped them earlier. Okay. I'm gonna add a little fresh parsley as well. Cornichons. Mm, I love those. You want one? Yeah, I do. Actually. Thank you. <laughs> we have about two tablespoons of these. We're gonna do two teaspoons, which I'm gonna put in now, okay. of the actual juice. Mince these up. I never really thought to put the juice. Yeah, I do that in my potato salad and tuna salad. This gives it a great acidic tang and brightness. So I'm adding fresh tarragon. Tarragon. And tarragon's one of those things. It's like a mild licorice. White pepper. A little salt. There we go. You want to try? Yes. Right? Oh my, got a perfect flavor. Are you expecting anyone else? Yes, Julie Benz is coming over. Do you I, know her? I do know oh, her. Good. Yay. Fun. All right, well, I'm going to finish off the roasted chopped salad. Okay. I'm going to finish off the crab cakes, and I have homemade Italian breadsticks. I, oh, yum. Yum. It's right. Girl lunch. Mm -hmm. All right, for our little lady's lunch, I'm finishing off my roasted veggie chopped salad. Yum. So my carrots and onions have already roasted for 25 minutes and we need 15 more minutes with the asparagus. Do you know the trick on how to cut your asparagus? Bend it. I don't think so, no. And let it snap. Then take oh. your bundle, right? And that's where you cut it off. Because that's where the bad asparagus is. Really? This is the good asparagus. Yum, look at that. Isn't that pretty? All right, I'm gonna slide my carrots over. Move over, carrots. And then I'm gonna add a little olive oil to these. Add a little salt and a little pepper. We'll put these back in the oven. Back into the oven. What now? Breadsticks. All right, so I've got Family. my dough. Ooh, look at how fluffy. So pretty, Isn't look that pretty? at that. Gorgeous. How long did that take to rise? Two different times, about 45 an hour each time. We're gonna cut this in about eight sections. Side's a little thicker. Do you bake? Yes, I love to bake with the kids. Yeah. And the problem with baking is that we eat everything. That's the problem. <laughs> it's the problem. You're so right. Yeah. Two I, for mommy, yeah, two one for, for you. Mommy. Oh, did I do that right? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to. All right, now I'm going to roll these out using an attachment on my mixer. Look at this. You can do this by hand, but this actually makes it a little bit quicker. So I want these about a quarter inch thick. This is kind of awesome. Kind of fun. And then we're gonna roll them. Okay. Longer Hi. ones. Hi. Hi! Oh my god, it smells delicious in here. I You're know. Like, How are you, Air Kiss? <laughs> Julie Benz. She's been in shows like Buffy the Vampire Slayer, Angel, and Dexter. I've known Julie for a long time. We did a crazy, silly movie years ago. It had many different titles, but I think this is the one it finally landed on. Shriek. If you know what I did last Friday the 13th. And yes, that's the longest title ever that a movie's ever had. <laughs> Do you guys want to help? Homemade breadsticks. I've yeah. never made breadsticks before. Welcome to <laughs> my house. Can I get you some wine? Yes, please. Did I say that too eagerly? No. <laughs> yes, please. Yes, yes please. please. Yes, please. So we just literally twist them. I stick them down. Wow, and then I just kind of flatten the ends so they stay twisted and they don't unravel. 
And they look really pretty when they come out, too. So, girl, what are you about to? Working in Hawaii right now. Well, I was <gasps> going to say, you're out of town. Oh, wow. no? I, I mean, know. tell me how that must be. Like, that somewhat, must be kind of I'm awesome. suffering from my art. <laughs> Look, that's where she's got this beautiful <laughs> golden we tan. Do. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for helping, girls. Of course. Yeah. I'm going to brush these with some olive oil. All right. These pretty ladies are going to go into the oven for about 10, 20 minutes at 400 degrees. All right. Let's go. All right. All right. These look good. Look at our pretty roasted veggies. Gorgeous. Ooh, so these that. are for my chopped salads. So I've got my lettuce. I have a, a mixture of romaine and iceberg, fresh uh, tomatoes from my garden. We've got garbanzo beans that have been rinsed and drained. And then we're gonna add our salami. Love salami. Got a little mozzarella. So now I'm gonna start on the veggies. Oh, these roasted veggies smell so good. So good. She's like an expert chopper, by the way. I'm just yeah. saying. I don't know about you girls, but I'm hungry. I'm, I'm starving. <laughs> I know. We're actors. Really always hungry. hungry. <laughs> I'm just gonna toss this with a simple vinaigrette. It's just olive oil, red wine vinegar, and salt and pepper. All right. So we got our beautiful chopped salad with roasted veggies. I think our breadsticks are done. Mmm, smells good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Look at how pretty we did, girls. Wow. Oh, those look great. Wow. Those gorgeous. You make it look so easy. You guys want to try one? Yeah, nice and warm. Thank you. No. Mm -hmm. Try it. Mmm. Yum. So good. So good. Mm-hmm. But I love these because they're perfect for a salad, you know, just to have them on the table. They might not make it to the table if you leave them sitting in front of me. I think you're right. <laughs> we can keep snacking. I'm going to get the crab cakes. <gasps> Hello, pretties. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Look great. I don't skimp for you ladies. <laughs> so we get our oil. We're gonna heat that up. This is our flour. This gives it a nice little crust on the outside. So we take our crab cake and we lightly coat it. Start these. All right. So about four minutes on each side. Four minutes, that's mm -hmm. it, huh? So I'm gonna finish up these crab cakes, mm -hmm. then I'm gonna plate them, and we're of course gonna eat, and then I'm gonna show you a little twist on a dessert that I did for you guys later. Yay, I'm so hungry. <gasps> oh, here we go. Oh, they look oh, amazing. So amazing. Mm -hmm. And this table's beautiful. Oh, Thank you. Thanks. It's important to get together with your ladies. I know it always recharges me when I have friends around and I can kind of you know, show them a little of my love through my cooking. This salad's amazing. The right. onions are so sweet. Mm-hmm. I like the lightness of the dressing mm -hmm. as well. It's not too heavy. Crab cake with the salad, it's a really good mix of flavors. Doesn't feel overly fried. Mm -hmm. And I love the tartar sauce. I love it. Yeah. Mm. Thanks for coming over. Thank you for having us. I know. Mm. I was gonna say, when you feed us like this. <laughs> are you shooting right now, Sasha? No, we just finished just our finished? sixth season. Yeah. Doesn't it seem like it goes by so fast? Mm, no. <laughs> do you know I used to do 32 episodes a year of Beverly Hills 90210? 13 a year. to a year, But how is people. that even possible? We like, would do two episodes time? at once. We'd have literally what they call double ups. I was such a big 90210 fan. I just wanted to be in the peach pit. <laughs> Know. You know what, when a show becomes so iconic yeah. and you know those sets, yeah. you just want to go in them. When I worked on Desperate Housewives, my first day on Wisteria Lane, I was tr I was trying to be cool, you know, I was coming off of Dexter, I was like, I'm a seasoned actress, and get out of the van, mm -hmm. and like, there I am on Wisteria Lane, and I just like freaked out. Did so you I'm really? Up and down the street going, oh my God, there's Susan's house, and, all, <laughs> and, like, and that's Don't where Maria lives. <laughs> Don't worry about filling up because I actually have a very light, refreshing dessert. Oh, awesome. So good. I'm going to take some home. <laughs> There's none left. <laughs> All right, now for the good stuff. We've got our basil lemoncello sorbet. It smells so good. And we're going to top it with a little fresh lemon zest. And then we also add a little garnish of basil. It's lemoncello time. My way, sorbet way. Right. Oh, pretty. Pretty. This is basil limoncello sorbet. Oh my god, it's so good. So, oh, so sweet. great. 
I love sorbet because it is more refreshing and not mm -hmm. as heavy as mm -hmm. ice cream after a meal. And you don't feel as guilty. Mm -hmm. And then it just has a little bit of booze in it. No, you know, like you can't get drunk off of it, but you can enjoy it. <laughs> I like that. Mm -hmm. Well, ladies, thank you for coming over. Thank you for so having nice us. Having this was you. beautiful. Thank, thank you. you. We'll do it more often. Mm -hmm. To many more times. Yes. Yes. We'll put these back in the oven. Mmm. So perfect for my mouth full. Yeah. It's so perfect. It's so good. Mm -hmm. to eat it on top mm -hmm. of the mouth full. Mm -hmm. This is so good.